So Mari was very helpful in teaching us to get to the heart of a problem instead of just to really go back and forth and understanding what your child is trying to say to you. So Mari was very good at doing role playing with us so that we could, my husband and I were able to practice this quite a lot before we tried it at home. So it's been very good. I have two children and with my six year old daughter, I would say that uh, kind of a combination of active listening and her own the problem and solve her problems has been huge. And overall the course has been very good for us. So my six year old, had some friendship issues at school, just as Mari has been talking about, and um, by drawing it out of her and getting to the, to the heart of what the issue was, then it, instead of giving suggestions, but really just listening, listening, she, it, it, was, it was nice and it's been easier to steer her towards a solution that she could solve for herself and that she could come to how she wanted to handle, how, how to handle the problems herself. Which I think overall, I mean, these, t you know, she's learning more to, to take care of her own relationships and how to handle conflicts with friends, and it's nice because it, in the past maybe it would have been, oh, maybe you should do this, with the best of intentions. But now, in jumping, instead of jumping to maybe you should do this, it's waiting and hearing and helping her try and find the solution herself, which she feels much more proud of herself for owning the problem and taking responsibility. I, you know, I spent the time really listening to her problem and how she felt about it. And that was nice because they'll tell you so much more. And that is something we've done with our kids a lot since this course. So it's been nice. With the brother and sister, teaching them to own the problem has been very good for them having conflict resolution. When they want to fight, they actually have to work it out themselves before we would step in more. And they actually are very good about dealing with it themselves now and working out something that they'll both be happy with. So that's been a huge change as well for us. So I think we listened before, but then we would suggest what to do. And now we listen and say, right, what do you think you should do? And that let them figure it out. And it's, it's, so it's just, it isn't that difficult to take that extra step to, instead of saying, here's what I think, it's just, what do you think? And it makes a huge difference because then they won't go to you the next time when they start, Ugh! You know, they work it out. They, ha they know that they're going to have to figure it out. And that has been, for me, in the, the course, I wanted to make more peace with the brother and sister, and, that's, and that has helped. So I have a, a boy who's nine, and he gets quite emotional and frustrated. And things have, by staying calm and doing the active listening, the, the quiet in my house is so much better. And that, so that the active listening is probably, out of everything, has been the biggest thing if he gets upset about something, instead of going bah, back to them, which is what we used to do, you know, he'd get like this and don't you talk to me that way. Instead of being, don't you talk to me that way, it's okay. You just stay calm and say, right, you know, I can see, you just, it's a matter of, I'll, I'll wait till you're calm or just, and, and then I can see you're upset about this. And so he trusts, the more we've been listening to him, the more he trusts that we will listen to him. And so he doesn't, he's, He's not needing to go, or he comes right back down pretty quickly. If he does go crazy, you know, he might get upset, but he comes back down quickly because we don't get upset with him. We stay calm and say, right, and just listen and listen, you know, continue to listen to the, whatever it is that he's upset about. And he, he feels happy that he can get it out. And uh, I think before we would listen, but we responded sooner. I think that's what the biggest thing is. We don't respond so quickly. We repeat, you know, we, we really try to understand him more and that makes him feel far more, he trusts us than that when we finally do kind of come to a resolving of whatever the issue is. He trusts that it's all been fairly done and he's had his voice heard and he feels like he's able to say, to be heard more. So it's been, it's been th th those have been the biggest improvements in our family and it really has made a huge difference, so it's good.